Yo guys, Dimani here with another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. So in this video today, we are going to be talking pretty heavily on LR Frieza. So I, I truly do believe that LR Frieza is going to be the next global LR. It may possibly not, just because I'm going to show you some timelines of what JP got and then, you know, like what we are getting right now. Um, the most reason why I think LR Frieza is going to be the next Dokkan Fest LR because it fits suit with this right here. Uh, but let me just show you guys what I see and so you guys can let me know what you think, okay? Alright, so we are going to go ahead and screen mirror, so I'm actually going to pop boop, over here. Alright, so one of the most wanted LRs in the global side of the game right now is obviously Kale and Khalifla. Now, I find it really curious that they, like, they are definitely due. We're almost at the 6th, actually April, yeah, we're at the 6th month mark. Um, so in like 10 days, the six month mark will actually be here for Kale and Khalifla. Um, however, uh, I really do think that they are like a tier above the rest. Um, Go Bros, you know, um, I think LR, like the new LR androids are really, really good too. But this unit is absolutely insane. And I don't think that they're going to give us LR, Kale, and Khalifla quite yet. Uh, reason being, I do believe we are going to be getting this Frieza first i know i know I, I let me show why okay so the reason why i think frieza first he was released in june 13th of 2019 on the global i'm sorry on the japanese side of the game um actually he was released two weeks guys two weeks after this guy right here so this guy was released on may 31st 2019 um and two weeks later we got the Frieza. So it, it, it seems like it's going to follow the same suit right now. I really do th think that this Frieza is going to be the next global LR. Um, I'm not sure when we're going to get Kale and Khalifla, but uh, it would be weird. It would just be kind of weird right now if they were to give us to Kale and Khalifla when they have, you know, the, this whole Goku uh, Dokkan Fest thing going on right now. Um, I don't think that's going to be the case. So uh, in my opinion, I think this guy's next. I would love LR Kale and Khalifla. But I really do think it's full power freeze, okay? If you think it's Kale and Khalifa, let me know in the comments. What I want to know is where the hell is our LR campaigns, man? I want to do, like, I never farmed out, the, like, the AGL trunks. Um, I'm waiting for his campaign to come, and it still hasn't arrived on the global side of the game. I feel like that campaign came, like, a year ago in JP. I'm at the point where, like, you know what? We're probably just not going to get it. So, I don't know where these campaigns are, guys. Um, I would like to see the, the Prime Battle uh, sell, but I still don't know where that one is either. Okay, uh, so the next thing that I want to talk about is this guy actually has a decent amount of like of farmable metals that you need to go grind out. Um, so I want to do a little bit of friend request from, oh, Amitosis sent me a friend request. I'll have to accept that. The epic launcher gives me so many pop-ups, it's not even funny. Um, anyways, so uh, you need to farm the Goku event. Uh, you need to farm it 7, 14, 21. You need to farm it three times. You can boost it if you want to, but you need to do the transforming Goku and the transforming Frieza. Get 21 medals of each of those. That's kind of important. Um, the other thing that I want to talk about is after you awaken him, he's going to need 35 of the, the new Goku event medals that just came out right now. That's why it kind of makes sense that it's all going to go together right here. Um, and I'm a little... I'm a little confused about this one right here so i know what event this is the full power freeze event uh the emperor of the universe but i think they actually increased the drop rate on this one um because back in the day even like the last time i farmed it because i think i was trying to awaken um this this goku because i just haven't you know like done it so I was like i'm gonna get him awoken but i think it was only giving me one medal at a time so um, reading some of the comments here, like you need 35 of these things. So if you get to beat this event 35 times, that's kind of a big deal. Um, but reading some of the comments, I think they boosted the, the drop rate. So I'm not actually going to find that out with the, in this video with you guys. We're actually going to go back over here to recording mobile. Um, and we're going to go run it really quick. Now, if it's only one at a time, uh, this is the only metal that I'm going to recommend uh, like holding off on. Obviously, I haven't run this event in a really long time. So it'd be a good thing to find out. Let's see here. We need transforming Frieza. This is like one of the best things that they added to this game, being able to, it's not transforming Frieza, it's full power Frieza. Uh, the evil emperor of the universe, it's that one right there. So we only have, okay, all right. So stage two on Z hard. 
Uh, I am going to boost this thing too. So what team am I going to bring? I'm trying to think what I have built right now. I think I actually have... I do have that team built. So we're just going to run that. And I do not have an option to boost it, which really sucks. So it's just going to be one medal at a time. I don't know when this event's coming back. Uh, it will come back if the LR actually drops. And I think that's actually when they're going to update the metal drops as well. So if you were to farm it right now, I think it would be one. If you were to farm it once the unit comes out, I think it's five to six. I think that's what they're telling me, guys. So uh, let's find out together, right? And I kind of want to see if we can just kind of one-shot this guy, which would be kind of funny. I'm pretty sure... Certain? I'm pretty certain. I'm pretty certain we can. All right, so full power Frieza. Oh my gosh, remember when enemies only had one health bar? Alrighty. Uh, yeah, this rotation's pretty good. <laughs> Let's do that, grab those, and I'm pretty certain uh, that's GG for uh, Tech Frieza right here. We really don't have a strong Dildo Frieza yet. We'll probably get one soon. Okay, so I got Super for 71 damage. Those are big numbers. Um, I'm pretty certain he is going to die right now. Great Death Beam. Yeah, 5 million damage. You forget how much defense units have these days too. Like that Golden Freeze normally doesn't do 5 million damage. He just does like 1 to 2. It's just that these older events are like, Oh, we can't, we can't move our characters. That's okay. Oh, you bastard. Um, it's okay. I'm just gonna super with Broly here and uh, is GG's. He's not gonna survive that. I don't know if he'll even survive the Janemba smack he's about to get in the face. Yeah, he might. No, he didn't. He didn't survive the Janemba smack he's about to get in the face because he got a critical. All right, so this should be the full power phase. And this is, should be the end of it right here. So let me see if I can get a key. Ugh. One, two, nah, it's not enough key. That's fine. Mm-hmm, 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 mm -hmm. and he's dead. So, I'm a little curious to see what our drop is right here, 263,000. Didn't get an additional, it's fine. Type disadvantage, it may not kill him in one hit, it probably will though. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's the event you need to farm. We got one medal. So, going back over here guys, we're gonna screen mirror again. Going back over here, I do think that once it comes out again, when, once this unit actually like drops, and I'm talking about, uh, where are you? Oh, I think I gotta go back. No, it's up here. Once this unit actually drops, I do think that they're actually going to increase the drop rate on that stage. So I, I, for this, uh, I don't recommend farming that 35 times. That's gonna be tedious as hell when you can, like if in the future, you'll need to farm it like six times, seven times. Uh, that seems way better. So, but definitely farm out the Goku medals. Definitely farm out the uh, the transforming Goku, and definitely farm out the transforming Frieza medals. Uh, for those that play JP, if you can kind of confirm with me in the comments that what I'm saying here is true, that what's up with this left, left bicep? What? Hold on. Eh, his left bicep is on top. Yeah, I could see that. Is like. Yeah, that's weird. His left bicep is on top, while his right bicep is, like, I don't know. That's that's, that's weird. Uh, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Let me know in the comments if you play JP. If you remember that they updated the drop rate on that event, I would love to know about it. Uh, and I will see you guys all on the next one. It seems to me that there really should be another stage. Actually, hold up a second. Let me check one other thing really quick before we, before we end this one. It seems to me that there really should be... Should be able to click this and Emperor of the Universe. So they did not add another stage to stage two, but it does say the drop rate is changed to one to six. So I, I really do think that is true, guys. Uh, I would hold off right now, and I think that the drop rate is going to change for sure. All right, guys, love you, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye. Uh, outro now.